morning. Good afternoon. <laughs> Welcome to a new week. My name's Nicola. If you're new here, I make vlogs, weekly vlogs, hauls, shop with me's, tips on fibromyalgia and ME, um, all the all the fun stuff. So, if you like all that, then subscribe away. And if you're excited for this week's video hit the thumbs up why not um yeah anyway so it's sizzling saturday today and it is sizzling it's sizzling outside it's like 23 degrees evie's doing a nut because artie's out artie's our tortoise if you didn't know or holly's tortoise anyway um so here's evie watching very carefully artie who's down there he's having a little explore aren't you art he loves being outside and Evie loves watching him. You gotta be nice though. I'll be nice. She says, Yeah, right. I'm not being nice. Today we are off, which is Mark and I, to an overnight stay um, in a hotel called the Mill Hotel. And that is in a place called Sudbury. It was Mark's birthday present from me. So he loves to have a night away, like just the two of us sometimes. Like we try and do it once a year if we can. Um, we usually do it for our anniversary, but we didn't this year. We did it for his birthday. So that's where we're off to today. I've got the polka dot dress of dreams on that I bought at Primark with Poppy last week. Let me balance you and show you so that you don't fall off. Stay there. Stay there. Right, so this is the polka dot dress of dreams, like that. It's cut here, so it's nice and flattering because it just then hangs. It has got long sleeves, I've just rolled them up because it's quite warm. So you can have them down like that. Um, I'm not sure whether to clip some of my hair back yet or not. Um, have some of it back or have it all down I'm not sure yet but anyway that's the plan for today so I'm just waiting for Mark to get home I'm gonna go and have something to eat because I'm starving and then we're gonna go for lunch I think and then we're check into our hotel so you can come with us we're off on our ollie bobs for one night for one night only one night only um where are we going Sudbury that's it <laughs> So we haven't had lunch yet, so we're going to go and see, we're going to the hotel first, aren't we? Yeah, head there, yeah. And then we're going to see um, if they've got a nice lunch selection or if we want to go somewhere else for lunch, if it's too fancy full for us. Because we're not the fanciest of eaters, are we? Speak for yourself, I'm very posh. <laughs> <No>. You liar. <laughs> So we're going to have a look and then maybe get some lunch there and then check in and then I'll do your room tour, um, we'll check out all the facilities, we're definitely checking out the bar facilities aren't we? Yes. <laughs> we want to walk around Sudbury as well, go around the little shops because I really like, I like that shop, I think it was called QD, where yeah. we got the... Christmas lights. Christmas lights and that from. I really like that little shop, so I want to go in there. Um, and yeah, just see what the day holds and then see where we're going to have dinner tonight as well because we don't know if we're going to eat in, again in the hotel or if we're going to eat out or what. Perhaps it looks a bit dirty plate Oh, uh, yeah, we don't want a dirty plate. By dirty plate, we mean like a little bit of food in the middle of your plate. That's what we call a dirty plate, not a plate that hasn't been washed. Um, so we're we're gonna have a look and assess the situation. Who sings that? I am assessing the situation. It's Fagin. It? Fagin from Oliver Twist. Of course, of course, of course. Right, let's get going. First stop is lunch. We we had a look at the hotel, didn't we? But we decided that we thought we'd come into Sudbury Town and we found a really cute, well Mark's found a really cute tea room. Um, I don't know what it's called, oh Huffers, Huffers restaurant. And uh, we've got a little, look at this table, look how cool this table is. It's so cool. 
So, what are you going for? Sausage baguette? Yeah. Got me tea. Um, and I've gone for a prawn sandwich. All right, we've had lunch. Now we're coming up to the hotel. We're going to check in and uh, go and get a drink. <laughs> of some description. But it's pretty, it's right by the water. And those seats over there have got our names on. We've just got to find somewhere to park. Of course, a bit tight around here. A bit tight. Right, found somewhere to park. And uh, now we're going to go and check in. Mark's got all the bags. <laughs> it looks really pretty. Here we go. Look how cool this is. That says River Room B. Are we sure we're down here? Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Uh, we've got to go upstairs? Probably. Right, I'll okay. get back to you. Oh, clonk, clonk. <laughs> it's like a maze. Is it? Thank you. Nearly there, nearly there. Oh, you've got the key card, haven't you? Number 47. There's our car out there. It's handy. Here we go. What's a dinky little room? Right, I have to show you. We've just, we just thought, oh, they've left us a bottle of champagne and two glasses. But it's from um, who Mark works with. Isn't that a lovely sentiment? Thank you, Mick. I know you won't watch my vlogs, but... <laughs> it's the last thing you watch. Anyway, let's go and investigate the bathroom situation. Is there a bath? No, no, yes. Is there? Yes, there's a bath. There's a bath, Mark. We can have our annual bath. <laughs> And a little shower. I, I reckon that's not going to be very powerful, you know. But it's very, very cute. Oh, what we got here? Uh, vitalizing shower gel and shampoo with ginseng. We've got body lotion and shampoo. Oh, that's good. I forgot to bring my hair thing. There's me. Hello. So it's a very cosy little bathroom, but that's fine. It's a cosy little room, isn't it? And then we've got, oh, we've got this weird portrait on the wall of someone on their horse. Let's look at the view that we've got. Got a nice cobweb going on. Can't escape from spiders. <laughs> isn't that pretty? That's so pretty. Right over there. So we were saying this is obviously the old mill, isn't it? You reckon? Yes, the old mill, yeah. The old mill. And then we've got, I'm not going to be doing any ironing, but there's an iron and an ironing board. I don't even think we'll hang our clothes up, are we? No, probably not. <laughs> we're only here one night, um, but it has got a fan, thank God, because I forgot to bring mine. These mugs are very posh, aren't they? I like those. What if it, are yours biscuits, Mark? Yeah. Oat crunch biscuit. What's this one? Chocolate chip cookies. And then we've got a big telly here, so yeah. Very cute. Right, we've got our drinks. Mark's happy because he's got what is that called? Atlantic Pale Ale. Atlantic Pale Ale. I've got my spritzer. We're just looking because we've got the menu. And it looks alright, but we think it'll still be. Plate, don't we? It's not going to be massive portions. No. So we're looking at um, this just eat delivery burger and more and eating in our room, which is. Uh, which one is it? Is that one there? That one. Or that one. One of them. Right at the end. Yeah. One, two, yeah. Third one. Yeah, that one. That's our room. Um, and then, because tonight is uh, the start strictly. And we sad like that. <laughs> I'm like, I don't want to miss it. 
because we love Strictly Come Dancing, so we might sit in the room, have our bottle of champagne, have our burger, watch Strictly, and then come back out for another drink afterwards, because the weather's glorious, isn't it? But look at our view. Look at this view we've got. It's so pretty. I just wish I could walk more, because I would be all over exploring that after a few drinks not gonna happen we just have to enjoy the view all right we're still here we're still drinking <laughs> we've had some fries Speak for yourself. <laughs> excuse me i've had two you've had four no three yeah four well, you had four two you're on your third now oh you're on your third and we've just been joined by a bunch of uh, cows grazing look at that they're just meandering across the uh the field there. Good afternoon. We're home. We're home from our, our weekend away. Um, my camera battery died while I was away, so I filmed one clip on my phone, um, but then everything turned a bit wrong and I was violently sick. I won't go into details, but yeah, it wasn't, it wasn't nice. Um, don't know why could be the medication could be something I ate or drank but then Mark was fine so who knows really and I still feel dodgy today like I've eaten a few bits and pieces um, but I just still feel a bit sicky not like I'm gonna be sick but I'm just sicky so I'm just taking it easy today um, just feel a bit drained really and also I didn't sleep very well because you know once you've been sick and everything you don't tend to sleep that good but yeah Mark's been doing a lot of jobs since we got back he's been working on the ensuite and hoovering and cutting the grass and all sorts making me feel like <laughs> just sitting there I've been watching vlogs oh actually I might watch some Gilmore Girls now that will, that might be a good shout um, I just keep getting up and moving every so often because obviously it's not good for you to keep sitting in one place so yeah Sunday Fundy sort of uh, non-existent today but it's been a Sunday rest day that's what it's been but hopefully um, tomorrow I'll be feeling better it does mean that jazz is out the window tomorrow again um, but I am going to be editing the HomeSense uh, shop with me and haul that you will have already had um, so I'm going to do that tomorrow and film another video for you and then Tuesday I'm going to home, not home, um, Hobbycraft, that's it, Hobbycraft because they've got some pumpkins in, some paper mache pumpkins that I want to do decoupage on and I also want to paint some and put polka dots on that I've seen people do and uh, make the stem all pretty and things like that and then display them so um, I'll definitely be taking you there with me and um, yeah then just bits and pieces really I've got my nails on Wednesday and I need to speak to them about my nails because yeah they're not not going well so I need to really say look I know it's not them it's it's even my medication or something that's making my nails break and come off but I'm not going to keep paying out if after a couple of weeks my nails look shocking so I'm going to speak to her on Wednesday and see what she says um, and then Friday I think I'm seeing my mum and dad because they've been on holiday last week so I need to catch up with them and hear her all about their trip Poppy's gone to see her friend in a show this afternoon and Holly's not feeling great she's got a uh, bad tummy pain which is like from all the problems she's having with her tummy so uh, she's not gone into work today but apart from that we're all smashing good afternoon my peeps it is exhausting Monday I am exhausted <laughs> Ow. don't laugh don't laugh because my back hurts <laughs> it feels like someone's gone on my middle upper back and my ribs and like crushing every time I laugh or sneeze or breathe 
that just is how it feels. But anyway, <laughs> don't laugh. <laughs> Why is it when someone says to you, don't laugh, do you laugh? Why is that? That noise you can hear probably is my laptop because I'm just um, doing a playback render for my Home Sense video. So that's what I've been doing this morning. I've been editing and now I'm going to have some lunch or brunch because I'm not eating anything yet today, surprisingly. And then after lunch, I'm going to film a hip exercise video for you that Poppy's going to film for me because obviously I can't do the camera and do the exercises. And then I might try and do a seated yoga to help my ribs and my back because it's not good. Now, I could just sit and do nothing all afternoon again like I did yesterday, but I don't feel that's going to be helpful to my back. So I am going to attempt a seated yoga, one from probably my teacher that I've got on uh, an email from when we had lockdown. I'm going to try one of those and see if that helps at all, but it really, really hurts. So I'm not sure if that's pulled muscles from when I was sick and combined with the fact that I've had two different mattresses over the last two nights, you know, the hotel one was like a rock and obviously my one is lovely. So my back is trying to get used to both and it could be medication again because last night I thought I was going to be sick again. So I'm wondering, because I have my tablet at night, whether that's what's doing it. So I'm still taking my tablet because obviously it takes your body a few weeks to get used to medication. So I will take, keep on taking it unless it keeps making me sick, you know, obviously. And see if my body can get used to it. Um, I'm actually really chilly now. I've got nothing on my arms, so I'm going to go and get a jumper on, get my lunch, sit and watch some Gilmore Girls. I, I'm still obsessed with that. I'm, I'm absolutely obsessed. I could easily sit for a whole day and watch back-to-back -back Gilmore Girls at the moment. I think that's probably what I did yesterday. Well, I watched a lot of YouTube yesterday as well. But anyway, ow, don't laugh, don't laugh. Um, let's, let's go and make some lunch and, and get on with this. And I'm trying not to yawn now as well because that hurts too. Right, just had a parcel arrive. And I think it's my little white pumpkins that I ordered from eBay. Yes, it is. So I could do some of these this afternoon, which would be quite fun. Um, oh, I can't get them out. Hang on. Bear with, bear with. There we go. So, these, how many have I got here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six white pumpkins. They're just like um, a foamy sort of fabric. And you can either paint them or draw things on them. Someone had drawn a haunted house on one of theirs, which I thought was quite good. Someone else had written boo. Um, you could just leave them plain white if you wanted to, but um, I'm going to do some things with these, so I might do a couple this afternoon. We shall see. But yeah, these I'll link them in the description, but they were off of eBay, and I think they were £6 something for all of them. So that's not too bad, is it? And then I can uh, style them up. Right, I've uh, decorated two of the pumpkins. So the first one... I um, made this haunted house which is a picture I just copied off of uh, Pinterest fairly easy to do and then wrote haunted house on the back so that's the first one and then the second one I just did orange polka dots all the way around but it's quite fun to do really and I really need them on different levels so like you can have one up high, one down a bit lower, one a bit lower, do you see what I mean? To give it different heights, but I'll sort that out when I've done all of them. At the moment I've only done two and I've still got four left, but I said the girls might like to do one as well. So um, I'll ask them and see if they're not bothered, then I'll do all of them. But yeah, I'm quite pleased with how those two have turned out. I really like the haunted house as well. I think it's quite, quite cool. Good afternoon. <laughs> I'll get it right one day, I promise. Um, 
It's only just afternoon, it's quarter past 12. It is Tuesday, isn't it? It's Tuesday. Um, what am I doing today? We're gonna nip to a uh, hobby craft. I've never, ever been in a hobby craft. So that's that. And I'm hoping to film little bits and pieces for you, but I'm not gonna do like a whole shop with me thing because um, it's my first time in there as well. So I want to have a look around. Um, but I want to get some more pumpkins because I've got some really nice tissue paper that I want to decoupage some pumpkins. So I'm going to be looking around there. Um, so we're going there in a minute. Me and Pops are going. And then we're going to get uh, treat ourselves to a McDonald's for lunch. We're going to bring it back here and have it in the garden. It's a beautiful day. It's really warm again. But I'm like, the, the warm, I love the sun, but the heat can go away now. So keep the sun, but get rid of the heat. So I want to put on my warm, cosy jumpers and my leggings and hoodies and I want all that now. I don't want to have to keep putting on vest tops and things. My shoulder blade, oh, I'm just going to swap because it really hurts. On both sides now are really bad and still got a little bit of that pain in my back from yesterday. It's not as bad like when I breathe it's more if I laugh or cough or do something like that it still hurts so I did a seated yoga this morning um, which was lovely um, it was all to do with upper body so it was quite apt really um, but yeah I was I was doing it thinking now should I go start doing seated yoga again rather than jazz is that going to be better for my body because I can't afford to do both because Seated yoga is £8 a session and jazz is £30 a month. So I can't afford to do both, but I could do one or the other. And I'm like, oh, I don't know. Because I like the way that jazz keeps all my muscles supple and it gets my heart rate up a little bit. Um, makes me sweat and makes me feel like I've worked out at the end of it. Whereas with a yoga session, I don't feel like I've worked out at all. But I feel like my mind and my body is in a much better place. So it's difficult really to know what to do there. But I'll have a think about it and and see. I'm hoping to do a jazz tomorrow morning, but if my shoulder blades are still this bad, then I'll go have to do another yoga, I think. Here we are. Let's go and see what we can find. She can't see. It's too bright, it's too bright. What's that, a rolling craft trolley? Hmm, three tier. Good idea, aren't they? Wouldn't that be good for like my stationery or like yeah. the, my schoolwork under yeah. my shelves? You know, in my bin is. Oh yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah. Oh, I want some orange paint. How much are they individually? There's two for three pounds. That colour's nice as well. Got all the colours. Wow, look at all this coloured card. Like a wall of card. Wow, look at this. They've got all these beads that you can make your own um, jewellery and stuff with. That's really cool. Poppy wants this. Let's show them. It's a colour your own playhouse. What's that one? Pi princess carriage. Oh, I thought you'd like that one. The shop. Yeah, a bit like house shop. Look at that fairy one as well. That's so cool. Oh, I've got some Halloween crafts things to do. Wooden skull, two pounds. Well, these, oh, they're heavy. One pound fifty and they've got a spider on its head. Cool. Here we are. Monopoly. Oh, is that wet? Or is it dried? It's wet at the back. Oh, um, yeah, it's soaking. Right, we've got our lunch. Hey, get away. Um, these are the Monopoly stickers, so you've got to right. put them off. Right, right. I'm getting a wet bum from the water in the thing. You want anything? Oh my god. What? What? What does it say? I don't know what that is, but anyway. You mainly want the free food. <laughs> you want the free food? Winner! Medium Coke Zero or Milkshake. What have I got? Sometimes you don't get any. Holiday? Yeah, no, you don't get any. 
Nothing. Let's see what me wrap brings. Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. A meal drink. Let's get stuck into our Monopoly McDonald's. Yum. Right, I'm just trying a mozzarella dipper. Mmm. Thank you. Should I put some That's on That's nice, yeah. I'm going to try it in a barbecue. Ugh, what is wrong with you? Yeah. No, better without barbecue. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Mmm. Good, aren't they? Yeah. Mmm. Right, we finished our McDonald's. We've just decided to have a spawn trip to um, the works because Poppy saw in Hobbycraft they had these painting money box things and she's having a sleepover on Friday so she's gonna, we're going to try and get some cheaper in the works um, and then I'm going to drop her off at the gym. I was just going to show you quickly what I bought from Hobbycraft. It wasn't that much because <laughs> we weren't that impressed. I went for pumpkins and I came out with none. And I've looked online because she said, oh, have a look on the website and had a look. Nope, all sold out. So I had a look on eBay, found them. They're like treble the price for one. So there's that. And yes, yeah, so I bought, I use this craft brown wrapping paper to wrap all sorts of presents, birthday presents, Christmas presents, any sort of presents because it's recyclable. And there's eight meters, I think it's three pounds thirty or something. Um, the other thing I bought was just this pack of paintbrushes. They're kids' paintbrushes, they were a pound for three, but I use them for my craft. I don't want expensive paintbrushes. Um, I'm kind of wishing I'd got that orange paint now, probably to use on these, on one or but then I'd only use it on a couple. So I put the orange paint back because we couldn't find the pumpkins. Um, I don't know. Anyway, we got these cake mixes. They're Betty Crockers, which are the best cake mixes. And Poppy has got this one to make, chocolate fudge brownie mix for when she comes back later. And I bought this one for Holly, which is a gluten-free devil's food cake mix. So thought she might enjoy that. Um, so that's all we bought. That is literally all we bought from <laughs> Hobbycraft. But we're going to go and dash off now to the works and then I will take Pops to the gym and then when I come back I'm going to do some more editing, funnily enough, and watch some more Gilmore Girls because I am obsessed with the Gilmore Girls. Christmas! Christmas! Christmas Poppy! Christmas! 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 Oh look we could use that for your mathematics with Poppy. Yeah, an expensive <laughs> whiteboard. I mean, you've got any chalk? We'll find one in the works probably. Oh. Don't let me forget. This is the garden centre, by the way. <gasps> a tree of gnomes, Poppy. A tree oh, of gnomes. September. I don't care. It's gnomes. How much are the. <gasps> Look at this little one. Look at this little one. Oh my god, $7.99. Look at him. Oh, look, I want a tree of gnomes. I want a tree of gnomes. Oh, it's moved, is it? What's this bit then? Oh, this is just a toy bit. I thought this was the works then. What is it? It's like five in a row wins. I don't get what you have to do with it. Okay, play is a head to head five in a row tile game. Challenge your friend, grab a stack and try to sneak um, a straight or diagonal line of five before they do. If you run out of tiles, you can reposition them until someone wins. Hmm. How much is that? 12 99 You could literally just put that on your bag. You? Yeah. That's a handy thing for college, isn't it? To play like mm. in <gasps> break times. Harry Potter double, 15 pounds. Fireman and Sam you used to have all this, didn't you? I, I swear I used to have this. Do I you remember you had that. the helicopter? I used to love the helicopter. Someone and, um, broke it. Yeah. yeah, you had quite a lot of these things. I used to love, I swear I had this. I don't know if you had that I or not. I swear I had something like this. Similar, but I don't know if it was that one. The boat? I swear I had the boat. 
You loved Fireman Sam, you loved Peppa Pig. Postman Pat. Postman Pat. What else did you play with? Happy Land? Yeah. The ambulance is new. They've Do you got, remember? They've got the whole 999 squad <laughs> going on in Fireman Sam now. Do you remember? There's a zip line. That I used to set up Happy Land in the garden for you on the play mat. I used to love that. <laughs> I think I had more enjoyment over setting it up than anything else. Oh my goodness. Hold it up. Let's go put it on. You're never going to be able to put it on, Poppy. Oh, for goodness sake. We'll get thrown out. Uh. <laughs> I told you it wouldn't fit, you nana. It could be a tool. What's the, what is that? Oh, it's a fireman one. I thought there were tools on it. I thought it was a, you could be a, a handyman. Tool. You could be a tool. You could be a tool. Yes. Look, there's a crochet dobby. I'm not crocheting. <laughs> I want a crochet dobby. Christmas puzzles. Christmas craft. Look, this is like the wooden scenes me and Mark collect for Christmas. Three pounds. What could I do with that? I suppose I could put some colour and glitter on the trees and the rooftops and things. I'm tempted, I'm tempted to get it as a project. I found it, Pops. There you go. Cool. Yeah. Mathematics with Poppy. Thanks. Resumed. No luck in there for the uh, paint your own money bank for Pops' friends, so we're going to go back to Hobbycraft on the way to the gym. Pops is going to run in and get them. I'll wait in the car. Drop her at the gym, back to edit. But there we are. Good morning, afternoon, what is it? Afternoon, half past 12. Good afternoon. It is Wicked Wednesday and I don't know if I'm digging my hair like this today or not. I don't know. Who knows? Um, I am off to have my nails done soon, thank goodness. So I'm going to obviously chat to her about the fact that they keep coming off and what we can do, blah, blah, blah. Um, she's also going to cut my toenails and paint them because they need doing. Yeah. Yeah, two sex, just got help, Pops. So Pops is coming with me because she's having her eyebrows waxed. That's the place where she gets them done as well. Um, what else are we doing? I'm just getting some editing ready funny enough here like this um, not sure how the medications going at the moment to be honest I'm not sure um, I'm holding back judgment on it as for feeling sick that's not too bad um, but now it's attacking the other end without saying what too much information <laughs> so um, yeah We'll just wait and see how that goes. I've got to double my medication from Sunday, so yeah, I'm a bit worried about doing that, but we shall see how it goes. Obviously, if it makes me too ill, then I'll I'll have to stop it and talk to the doctor. Why is it sunny? I know. Go away. <laughs> me and Pops don't want the sun. It well, it's not so much the sun. It's just that. I want the colder weather to come now, the warmer, woolly jumper, Jacket cozy, weather. long boot weather. Yeah. Um, Get away. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's actually, do you know it's the first day of autumn today? Pops. She's gone. Um, yeah, it's the first day of autumn today as well. But um, it's still really, really sunny and really warm. Like I say, I love the sun, it's just that I don't want this heat anymore. I've had enough of heat. There's a nice breeze actually coming through, but I managed to do jazz this morning. Um, it was a low jazz, which was really good. And we did some band work as well. Where, but the only problem with the band work was where the bands were, it was hurting my skin. So obviously my skin's very sensitive at the moment. Probably another thing to do with the new medication. But I did that, and... I don't know what else I've done really. Just bits and pieces. Not it's towel wash day. <laughs> That's exciting. That's the content you signed up for, isn't it? We're back home. Um, I've got my little follower with me, haven't I, Eve? She won't leave my side today, will you? 
Hmm? No. Right. Here are my nails. So I went for the autumnal colours. I did a poll on Instagram and these were the ones that won. Um, this one here is made by having a base coat of a colour and then she used like a gold sheet um, over the top and it, it sort of leaves the gold on the nail. So that was quite clever. But what I, we've done is we've made them a bit shorter and see how that goes really. Um, because, you know, they weren't doing well before. So let's see how this lot go. And my toes, I love the color on my toes as well. It's like this burnt orange. Can you see? Hello. <laughs> um, yeah, it's really, really pretty. So I've still got some glitter. Can you see the glitter on my toes from my last nail polish? <laughs> There's everywhere that glitter. Look at what I've just picked. Blackberries to make a crumble, but there's not that many at the moment. So I thought I might freeze these and then go back and get some more a bit later. That noise is the washing machine, by the way. Um, so yeah, but yum. Blackberry and apple crumble, here we come. Good afternoon, 20 past 12. Why do I always pick the camera up at like, just gone 12? Oh, it's gone all blurry. There we go. Look at the state of me, I've just come back from going out with Evie and I just look a mess. So welcome to Weird Thursday. Going to show you quickly, let's put this light on, the progress on the ensuite, which isn't very much at the moment, um, but Mark has like leveled the floor. Um, so that's the job that he's done so far. So there's the shower tray. Um, the window is being done on the 30th. So I guess that's the next job plus the drainage outside. But that's as far as we've got at the moment. But he did this last Sunday. Um, the electrics still haven't been moved yet, so that's got to happen as well. But that's as far as the ensuite has, has got. It's difficult for Mark to do anything else where he's waiting for, you know, other jobs to be done. So that's as far as we've got. Right, I need to put some makeup on this face and sort my hair out because it looks just a mess. And then, funny enough, I'm going to be editing. I'm not used to this car, sorry. It's quite hot. <laughs> it's quite hot. Reunited <laughs> and it feels so good. <laughs> I'm sorry if I stink of garlic. <laughs> I've had my garlic tonight, I'm really sorry. I've just mouthwashed, no? no? I've just mouthwashed. Yeah, I've just mouthwashed. Don't want to stink them all out, do we? It's Friday then, it's Saturday, Sunday, what? It's Friday, it's Friday, and we've made it to the end of the week. Whoop, whoop. We've made it Eve. Eve's got the ump because she's just had a shower bum. Because who wet their bottom on mummy's chair this morning? And Evie did, a wee wee. So that's my fault because I didn't put a nappy on her. So she's just going to go out with the in disgust now. Um, another beautiful day. I am assured by the weatherman that the weather is supposed to get cooler next week. I'm crossing my fingers. So hopefully autumn can start next week. Um, the weekend is supposed to be nice still. It's supposed to get up to like 24 degrees today. Unbelievable. And we're, I'm off today with my mum and dad. I haven't seen them since they've been away and we need to catch up. So we're going for lunch at a garden centre. Um, and then I might take you with me for a bit actually. Usually I don't film on a Friday. Um, usually I give myself Fridays off because, you know, it's a lot filming every single day. <laughs> um, but I might take you with me, show you what I'm having for lunch, that sort of thing, show you where we are, um, and then end the vlog there. So 
stay tuned for that to come and what else am I, oh I've already taken Poppy uh, to college because she's staying over her friends tonight so I had to drop, usually she gets the train but I had to drop her off at her friends to drop her stuff off so she didn't have to carry it around college all day and then come back which is a bit of a task for me because mornings are not good for me as you know so to drive in the morning I just drove in my pyjamas I put a cardigan on by the way has anyone driven in their pyjamas before with no bra because where do you put the seat belt <laughs> it's like <laughs> one of my boobs was like squashed up the side I had to like put my seat belt over the top of it anyway <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's just so funny. I thought I had to mention it. Uh, let me know in the comments if you've ever done that. <laughs> or is it just me? Probably. Probably just me. Um, right. I need to get on, finish getting ready, and then see my mum and dad. By the way, stonking headache. Choir was good last night. Sorry I didn't film anything. Um, I filmed, obviously, Angela coming in the car. But then it was the first day back and it was all like new and and there was new people and I just felt like I could whip the camera out straight away. So apologies for that. Um, but yeah, we had a good time at choir. It just felt a bit strange. It felt a bit, I don't know, just a bit weird because we haven't been there for 18 months. All the chairs were like a metre apart, the doors were left open all night, so we had millions of daddy long legs coming in, flying around, I was buzzing them, batting them with my book. Um, obviously I always have a good time with Ange, so that's nice to see her, but it just felt odd. I don't know if anyone else felt like that, but I just felt a bit odd. Um, and yeah, I came home with a really bad headache, and I've woken up with the same headache, so I'm going to take some tablets. That's reminded me. Right, now let's go and see what we're going to have for lunch. Look at the lipstick on the cup. That's terrible. That's supposed to be a stay put lipstick. It's stay put on the cup. Um, I've gone for egg mayo. Dad's gone for fish finger sandwich. That looks a bit well done, that fish finger, doesn't it? Yeah, a little bit crispy. <laughs> oh, and mum's gone for jacket because oh, we didn't well know what gluten free bread they had. But you don't like the bread, do you? No. Unless it's toasted. I'll be fine. So mum's got a jacket potato. The salad looks nice. It's got a dressing on it. Yeah, that's mm. So that's good. Sweets. Yeah. Mm. Mustard. Yeah, salad. <laughs> mum's whispering so she's not. Sorry. <laughs> We're just waiting in uh, the queue to go into Tesco's because of the fuel shortage crisis that's going on in the country. Everyone's panicking like the toilet roll situation. And they're all queuing up to try and get fuel, so we can't get into Tesco's. Diesel sold out. Um, we can't get into Tesco's because we're waiting for everyone to get their petrol. Anyway, um, had a nice lunch, walked around the garden centre, got a couple of Christmas presents, got Evie a treat for a change because usually she can't have treats, so that was nice. She'll enjoy that. And um, then we're just going to go around Tesco's, and then I'm going to go home and edit this and get this up and ready. So I hope you've enjoyed this week. Don't forget to do the usual. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not done already. And hit the bell for future video notifications. Um, leave me a nice comment below. And I will see you all on Wednesday. What is it? Oh, it's another haul. It's another haul. So make sure you're ready for it. Love you all lots. See you next week. Bye.